This video is for 6.2 homework, question number 15. Let's see, stack crunch get diff different decimal or no? It should be pretty close though, so let me take a look. Alright. Um, which distribution should be used to conduct the confidence interval? Um, should we use normal or should we use T distribution? Let me take a look. So, um, oh, look at that. The population standard deviation of the yards per carry for all blah 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 is 1.24. Look, they gave you the population standard deviation. So if they gave you that, we're going to go with z-test. We're going to go with the normal distribution. So click on normal distribution because population standard deviation is known. Um, A says, use a normal distribution because population standard deviation is known and the data are normally distributed. Did they say that part too? Let me see. Oh, yeah, they also did. They said, assume the yards per carry are normally distributed. So the answer is A, but I don't think that was the part. I think the, the, the question the student asked me about was this part. So let's go ahead and create a confidence interval. I'm going to send this data to StatCrunch. I'm going to go open up Z test, not T test, but Z because they gave us a population standard deviation. One sample with data because we have data typed up in here, right? All right, click on it, but you need to make sure that you type in the standard deviation given, uh, which was 1.24 for my problem. So I guess a common mistake is that people don't type in the population standard deviation. If you don't type that in, then you're not going to get the exact answer, right? Alrighty, confidence interval for 99%. And if I hit compute, I get these two numbers. So I'm going to go ahead and type those. Hold on a second. I want to look at both screen. The 99% confidence interval is from 3.94 to uh, 5.22. I have a strong feeling it's just that sometimes I forget to type in this population standard deviation given. So you need to make sure you do that, okay? All right, it says interpret the result. We are 99% confident. With 99% confident, it can be said that the population mean yards per carry is between the bounds of the confidence interval. So that's that's how you can find the 99% or 95%. You just have to make sure to type in the population standard deviation.